Hey okay, guys, Retro here. Today we're going to uh, tie the shaving brush and merger. So let's get started. Um, we're using a C49S Mustad size 12 caddis curd hook. We're going to use some nymph dub. Use a little bit of deer hair. And we're going to use a biop for the body. So let's get started. First of all we'll put a thread base down. bring it bound down through the body a little bit there and um, we'll just find ourselves a decent buy up in black and uh, we'll just tie that in point in first Sometimes these can be a little bit brittle, so we have to be very careful how we wrap these in so as not to break them. The body only goes up to about there, so what I'll do is I'll get um, these uh, pliers here. If I can get them off my gallows. Actually, we'll do. we won't bother with that, we'll just get that around. What we're trying to do is get a segmented body if we can. It's a bit awkward. Just wrap it up. Quite a simple little fly to do. Nicer if you haven't got fat fingers, but anyway. Just the way of the beast. Okay. Now that'll be far enough, I think. Put it back down again. Okay. It doesn't need to be too uh, fantastic. All we do now is we'll cut ourselves some deer hair. Just a nice, healthy little clump. Um, just so this thing floats. go pull out as much fuzz as we can nice little toothbrush is pretty handy well, well obviously a new one but not a little gammy one and let's just find our stacker pop that in the hair stacker a few good taps direction put it up on the body maybe about there somewhere now you don't have to flare it quite as much as that but I'm going to Chop that off, get rid of the waste, just wrap those through there so it locks that in. Now bring your thread forward. You can see it's taking shape already. Get a bit of dubbing and keep this reasonably sparse. And all this is is just to create a nice thorax. I like using the UV type dubbings. And we just bring that around there like so. Bring it up at the front. And I think uh, that's pretty much it. So we'll just get the whip finisher. Sorry, pull that back. I think I'm losing my voice. And don't say that's a good thing. 
aren't they? Now, there you have Retro's shaving brush. What we can do, that'll float pretty well. With the body, we can put a little bit of uh, Sally Hansen's on just to finish it off, or we can use some UV uh, type adhesive. Um, that's, you know, down to the individual at the end of the day. Put that on there. You know, it's not, not necessary, but you can pop a little bit of Sally Hansen's on there. Get a bit of a shine. Like I said, that's just to make it a little bit more durable anyway, so. Okay, thanks for watching Tight Lines and Screaming Reels.